They got them uh, a BMW X6 over here, you guys. These have always been one of my favorites. Let's go. Welcome back to Chuck's Daily Hustle, everybody. Let's just jump right into the video, man. If you guys at any point do like anything, make sure you go ahead and give your boy the thumbs up. Let's check out some of these cars, you guys. And we're going to be checking out some newer stuff. And then we're going to move over to some stuff that's wrecked. So um, we got a 2019 Ford Mustang. And I'm going to just tell y'all off tops, man. I don't really know about all these newer cars, you guys. I stick to cars that I actually sell, but I wanted to make a different video for you guys today. So I think this thing's got a V6. I don't think it's got the 5.0 in here. Let's start her up. See what she sounds like. Do do do. Yes, that is a V6, but it has 22,000 miles on here, you guys. We are at Mannheim Auto Auction, you guys. Um, so that is a dealer only auto auction, you guys. The reason why these cars are here is because, you know, they basically are like fresh trade-ins from bigger car dealers and they're running through the auction or the, you know, people are just trying to get rid of their inventory or whatever. So um, for all the people that know everything, no, this is not a, like a public auction. It's not like trashy cars out here. There is some trashy cars, but there is a lot of nicer cars out here too. Um, anyways, let's just look at, these, at this joint real quick. I haven't been in one of these in a very long time. Um, just pretty basic you guys so like i said it's probably the v6 in here um comment below let me know out of the cars that we do see today let me know if you guys like um the cars oh man how much would you pay for them man um what else we got out here we're not just gonna do muscle cars today y'all looks like we got an acura i think these are mdx's if i'm not mistaken this should be an mdx um i like this right here i like this and yes i am correct this is a mdx um sh package it looks like all-wheel drive never even heard of that package so i'm not gonna act like i do or i have um interior is really spacious y'all seven passenger joint this is something i can rock with this is acura is a, is a honda just so you guys know um but this is something that i could like drive daily and this is kind of sexy though in my opinion just a regular schmegular truck y'all dependable sunroof let me get that off before they give us a copyright claim Forty-six thousand miles on this one you guys it is a 2018 so let's move on to the next one see what else we see that we like they got a jeep rubicon over there y'all should i jump over there real quick for you yeah why not jump over here this is a 2020 with 8,000 miles on it somebody most definitely didn't have this in the mud for sure i've always loved these man as should y'all let's jump up in here on the... hey y'all see that sitting as tall as that uh pickup truck next to us you guys Let's start her up. Just a regular old, regular old growl, but I like it, I love it. I would most definitely take off that roof and them doors. All the radios is up on here, but no, I like this one for sure. Let's see what else we got. Let's see what else we got out here, y'all. I know a lot of y'all like pickup trucks. I don't really know too much about any pickup trucks. I'm not gonna lie to you, no matter what year it is. Uh, Q5, or is that, oh, this a Q8? Oh, okay. It's not the RS Q8, but it is a Q8, and this is sexy. What year is this thing? Hold on. It's the S-Line, it's got the S-Line package. It's a 2021, y'all. Yeah, there you go. This joint nice. This joint nice, y'all. I like that black grill, that black Audi grill. I like the rims. Oh, they got the painted Brembo's down there. Okay, the red calipers, y'all. Look at the interior. 
Look at the roof. Yeah. Let's give her a start up. Just nice and sexy, y'all. Nice and sexy. Did you hear the welcome when you got in there? That that was beautiful. I like that. Yeah. Here we go with the copyright claims, man. Dang. I had to power that joint off. Anyways, man, the uh, double screen right here is dope. I most definitely are already, you guys already know I love that dash on the uh, newer models of the Audis. But yeah, no, I would I would dry this. This is this is really my cup of tea right here. Wait a minute, hold on, y'all. I forgot about the Lincoln Navigator. I just did all my Ford guys bogus. So they got a 2019 Ford, uh, I mean, not Ford, Lincoln uh, Navigator, you guys. And yes, there's a beautiful grill on this joint. Beautiful rims. This thing is sexy, man. This is about one of the sexiest trucks you can get. Most definitely underrated, if you ask me. Um, I mean, you're they're de they destroy Chevy as far as like the the luxury part portion of this goes. You guys, we're talking about wood grain. Like, look at look at that, man. That's a whole nother level right there. Let's go to the front real quick. You got the running boards. Look at that, man. Wood grain all through this joint. Now, this is whatever you want to call it. You put a name on it. What is this to you, man? Look at that. Tell me that's not a beautiful scene back there. Most definitely, y'all. Um, this thing's got 42,960 miles on it. So let's see what else they got. They got a whole bunch of new cars out here, man. I may have to make a separate video for the um, the Carnage videos or the salvage vehicles, whatever you want to call it. Because uh, I'm seeing a lot of cars out here. Um, if you guys want to actually see like me test driving cars, make sure you check out my test drive videos with the cars that I'm actually buying. Right now, I'm just window shopping for myself and y'all. So uh, maybe one day we'll be able to afford all of these. Yeah, I think so. Oh, that's pretty nice. I like that. That color. I like that grill. This is a 2021. It says it's a Jeep Sahara, but it's a Wrangler, of course. This is different. This is different than the other one. Oh, you get oh, it smells good too. Like it smells just like uh like brand new car. It's been a long time since I smelled like a really, really brand new car. That smells really good. Um, what else is down here? Let's see what else we like. They got a Range Rover over here. Or Land Rover, little baby Discovery joint, 2019. Jeep Grand Cherokee right here. This just a regular Jeep. It's not looking like it's like a SRT or anything like that. They got a Ram pickup over here though. Nice red. You gotta love that, y'all. What year is this joint? Um, this is a 2019, 31,000 miles on it. This looks good, y'all. This is just a regular, sexy red Ram 1500, you guys. One of my favorite pickup trucks. Like I said, I don't know too much about pickup trucks, but the, the Rams, I rock with them, y'all. That's all I can say. So, got a Porsche Cayenne right here. It's a 2020. I stopped liking Porsches around like 2000 nine i feel like they're all the same to me um as far as like the body goes they haven't really changed anything to me um but i mean of course like if you can afford it why not you know what i mean like they're still nice um trucks pick or cars pickup trucks not they don't got no pickup truck talking about um <laughs> cars and like suvs mini suvs crossover type joints um they are decent looks like this came from a different this car came from a different auction um and they brought it down here so but yeah pretty decent you guys um just a regular chrysler 200 right there nothing special see these are like cars that i would normally mess with like something like this with a cracked windshield that's when i come in i'm gonna go ahead fix that windshield fix the repairs that it needs and make some money on it you know what i mean um but let's see what we got over here y'all we got a Toyota Tacoma right here. These things are worth um, their weight in gold. You can make some money on these. 
A lot of people love Toyotas and they love the smaller pickup trucks because they can do certain jobs that the big ones can't. I actually had somebody buy a uh, Chevy S10 pickup from me um, and he had to buy it because he had to work on like a golf course and they couldn't use the regular 1500 truck. So um, shout out to the smaller trucks, man. Um, but let's see what else we got right here. We got a Lexus. I don't know too much about this thing. It's a 2019. I don't even know what type of Lexus this is. Um, it does look sleek, though, for sure. It's an ES350. Okay. The interior is decent. Nothing too spectacular. Like, nah. I'm not in love with it, but it's cool. What else we got? Then we got this car that I hate with a passion, y'all. I will always hate these. Yo, if y'all watched my vlogs, you know how much money I lost on one of these. When I bought one, I lost for like four grand on a deal messing with one of these Pathfinders. So, never again. Um, Chevy Impala. Shout out to the Chevy Impala lovers, you guys. This looks like it's an LTZ package on here. Uh, this one is a 2014 with uh, 65,000 miles on it, I believe. This, yeah, it's an LTZ. This got the same package as the one I had, y'all, without the sunroof. Though I did not have the sunroof. I had the LTZ2 2015. That was my personal car for years. I bought that thing brand new. Um, yeah, I, I did love my LTZ. The only thing I didn't like was in the winter. Cause I'm in Minnesota, y'all. So like, when it like, if it was snow on the ground, then it would fishtail, which is very weird with a front wheel drive car. So it was unsafe to me. Um, that was my personal experience. So um, we got a. I know, I know this car. It's a GMC. What the heck is this name? A Katy. Okay. <laughs> a Katy. I wasn't thinking it was a Katy. I think it was thinking it was the. Uh, what is it? The GMC Terrain or whatever the heck you call it. This is just a. Look, mom, mom edition right here, y'all. The SLE package, nothing too spectacular. So we are now over here at the insurance land, you guys, trying to see if I can find some stuff to actually sell. Um, then I'm also gonna show you kind of these newer cars. Um, they got a 2021 Mitsubishi. What kind of Mitsubishi is this, man? I don't even mess with these things. Outlander Sport. So this thing is in the insurance lane because of front end damage. So this doesn't even look that bad. Like you could really make some money on this. I don't even think you need this assembly. Looks like all that plastic just broke, but that doesn't look too terrible. Let me see if the airbag was deployed. No, this wasn't. Start it up. Still smells like a new car. Okay. 1,667 uh, miles. Yeah, that's crazy. Let's see what else is over here, y'all. Do, 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 anything that I... This one sold already, the Subaru. So we just trying to see if... There is anything that I can make some money on. They got a Malibu over here. It's a 21 with 19,000 miles on it. That is out of my price range. They all are really from what I'm seeing. What you got Ford Expedition right here, y'all. 21 with 25,000 miles on it. Somebody about to eat, eat off these cars. Especially if they got clean titles. If you got the means to do so, man, you can make a lot of money fixing up these cars, especially this newer stuff. Got another Tacoma. This one smashed up in the front. Let's see. Dodge. Oh, no, that's a, a Toyota Tundra. I'm tripping. Thought that was a Dodge. It kind of got me. Let's see. This is what I can make money on. <laughs> oh, nine. Ford Fusion. I know this car, y'all. Let's see if she start up. 
She dirty, needs a little cleaning. She started right up. I'm gonna have to step my game up, y'all. I gotta start buying some more expensive cars. Let's see if this blower motor works. All right, boom, that works. Let's see. All right, that works. Radio did what it needs to do. Let's see. Okay. Boom, boom. All right. Let me see the back. Something got to be messed up on here. Then they got a, a Lincoln Zephyr over here, too. It's got a flat tire, but that's terrible. That's a little beat up on that side. But just checking out this real quick. This don't look too bad, man. This doesn't look bad at all. Put this one on the test track real quick, see if we can make some money. Let's see what she do. Shifting good. Okay. We're up to 40. 50. 55. 60. All right, it needs front brakes and rotors for sure. I'm wondering why this car is in the insurance lane. I'm going to have to look it up. Sometimes they'll put like cars into the insurance lane that are never be able to get a title. So this might be one of the ones. So we just gotta kind of double check before we get the bidding on stuff. So anyways, let's drive it. One more time down this way. Try to get it up to speed. All right, there we go, man. I'm gonna put this one on my list. Might be able to make some money. They got them uh, a BMW X6 over here, you guys. These have always been one of my favorite trucks, or they're not, it's not a truck, it's an SUV. Um, this joint looks nice. It's missing a grill or part of a grill on there, scraped up right there. I guarantee you that this thing is not going to start up. Nope, did not start, it's dead. Um, but yeah, this is a pretty decent car. So sometimes, man, you can find you some some beat up cars, and um, you know you can get some good deals. Like obviously, those are the ones that's running, but these ones are more than likely not running over here. You got a Mazda Six right there that's destroyed. Um, what is this thing? I don't even know what this is. I'm missing the whole front of it. It's all wheel drive. It's a Kia. It's a Kia Sorento or something. I bet. Yep, Kia Sorento. Um, they got a, a Skyon TC right here, you guys. This one is terrible looking. Looks like they spray painted it. This thing looks terrible. This thing looks cracked windshield. I'm not getting in there though. Yeah, this is disgusting. This is nasty. This is, yeah, that, that ain't something I wanna rock with. Ooh, they got a Benz, a E-Class over here, y'all. What we got, man? So, oh, wait, with 124,000 miles? Oh, it's already been sold. Dang, they need to come get their car. They got lucky on this one. I wonder if it runs. Let me see if it runs. If it runs, that's dope. break no it's not starting well whatever man anyways man i gotta get out of here you guys i gotta go pick up my son if you guys enjoyed the video boy most definitely like i told y'all before man give the boy the thumbs up the subscribe hit the notification bell all that good stuff you guys um i will see you on the next video i'm out peace